Josh, a 5-1 yeah. uh, victory away on a Tuesday night in Bristol Rovers must uh, must give uh, you and, and everybody in the squad and, and the backroom staff a, a big lift. Yeah, of course, you know, uh, it's always hard coming to these type of places. Um, we know that we're on a, a, they were on a sticky form coming into the game, but with the weather and stuff and the, the, the dramatisation of, 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 of sort of how it was made with the, the pitch nearly being on the water and stuff, it could have been a tricky situation for us to come, but we've got a lot of uh, strong-headed people in there, a lot of experience and a lot of talent, as, as I think was on show tonight, so it was important that if, that we came here and done what we needed to do tonight was, was well and capable for us. Back the first goal after a fairly cagey start. Yeah, of um, course. And then uh, Dylan Phillips stepping in for Declan Rudd, uh, put my two crucial saves. Yeah, you? very, very good saves. You know, I, just, I think it just shows the depth in our squad, you know, even though Dex a massive player for us and he's our number one, with, if he steps, a, he has to step out, then Dylan can step in and he, he more than filled his shoes, or his gloves as they call it, and made two fantastic saves, but I think we're trying to try to iron out the kinks and, and formation against formation, and as you say, it was a bit shady to start, but I think if we were managed to stay in the game past the first period, I think that that, that quality, we only needed one chance, and when someone with, with Adam Willa Lookman and the, the team, he only needs half a chance, and he shows what he's able to do. And he bagged his goal and then of course set, uh, started the move to, that set you up for yours. Uh, probably was aiming for you in the first <laughs> instance, but uh, Adam Chesson did superbly to rescue that ball to get it back to you. Yeah, of course, you know, I think um, with the energy we have in the wide areas, I think it was, it was more important for Nuge to make sure that I wasn't left isolated in the box on my own. And when you make those late runs into the box from a, from a wide man, you've just got to stay on your toes. And he's worked wonders to get it back to me. And, and then it was just up to me to try and put it in the net. And, and thank God it came off for me. And it's been... Uh, Times in the past, and maybe a danger at this time, tune it up uh, at half time, and uh, a lot of fans looking in probably think, right, we're going to coast the second half a bit. Yeah. We tried to get maybe, maybe did against Port Vale, or, although that may be doing Port Vale an injustice, but yeah. we went on and emphatically and admittedly they went down to 10 men. But. Yeah, exactly, yeah, that's that's the thing. and. It's just the, the, we said at half time that we, we couldn't come complacent, you know, because regardless of the scoreline, there's there's some talented players and some very, very good teams if you let them play. And if we had to let the Bristol Rovers play, I th they have more than capable to punish us. Uh, I think it showed sort of when we slackened off a bit towards the penalty that they have got the quality and it was important for us to stay dominant in the game and, and we knew that even though we scored two if we continued to do what we do there was more goals there for us and, and that's what we managed to show today so even though it was 2-0 at going into the break and it could have been edgy we were more than confident that we could go on and win uh, emphatically that we did. You and self and Nicky Jose, uh, Nicky Jose both on the score sheet yeah. um, setting up a nice little partnership up there. Now. Yeah it is good yeah we started off the season um, playing together and then sort of teared away we were playing well as a team but the goals and results just weren't coming and, and, and that's just the way football is sometimes but we've managed to strike a partnership I think uh, more importantly the players around us know our games individually you know that like the hustle and bustle of the game and Nicky likes to, 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 uh, to link it up so we're on the same wavelength at the minute which is fantastic it's always good playing with a partner it takes sort of the load off you and, and vice versa so playing alongside each other both scoring both getting on the score sheet and, and, and getting in amongst the goals is, is more important for the team. And you've had a full-on few weeks uh, international duty, starting for Northern Ireland, and then uh, there was a hint that you picked up a bit of an injury in that break, and yeah. everybody back here was a little bit worried, but you've come here and uh, uh, like, uh, like no, no problems at all. Yeah, international duty's been absolutely fantastic. Managed to, to, to fit in there when Jimmy Ward was out injured, so the same fun, the same fundamentals there are the same fundamentals here, regardless who steps in. You, you know what's expected of you, and then coming back, I think it was overplayed a bit to, for Scunthorpe, maybe not to know the team, but... To me, coming back, the, the medical staff here and, and Nuge took care of me and, and they got me right for, for the game on Saturday and we, we managed to go on and, and win the game then. Oh, tonight, thank you very much indeed. Cheers, thank you.